Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to James Cameron's Avatar of the Game as the Navi. Last time, we uh, actually kind of figured out that we are a very, very important character. We may be the first voice, which allowed us to actually, without shards, get the last Willow Harmonic and find the Well of Souls. So now we're going to talk to Tanjala. Oh, Kendra is here at the home tree as well. She's safe and sound. And we're going to talk to... It is honor to ride with you. And talk Easy to Tanjala here. Still me. Let's get rolling. And get going to the Well of Souls. We ride to Gaulite. What about Tantas? Gaulite. I explain as we ride. Okay. Well, good enough for me. Uh, Plains of Goliath. Alright. I'm assuming this is one of the locations that the RDA and the Na'vi have in common. Because uh, the Na'vi have most of their own locations, if you play as the Na'vi, and the uh, RDA also have most of their own locations, if you play as the RDA. So, given that they give us both names here, I'm going to assume that uh, we could play on this like map. Uh, as either side, or this sector as either side. So the Will of Souls is in Tantus, but we're going to Galite. Wanna tell me why? Galite leads to Tantus, but path is blocked. Blocked? By what? Tartu! Repair! Battle comes. I scout path. You follow Navi to Bedamu. He waits for your help. We are close. Alrighty then. What was that? Tanjala. Uh oh, that didn't sound good. I hope Tanjala's alright. Let's get the tree of vision here and then see what happened. Go, go, go. We gotta make sure Tanjala's okay. Oh wait, this is is this Baidama over here? I don't know what happened to Tanjala. It sounded like he got hit by something. Like an arrow like uh, some Shots were fired, but I didn't hear anything. I don't know. For a fight here or what? The pass to Tantus is held by the Tatu. We must attack the commanders. Put their force into disarray. Grunts will not know what to do. How the hell do you know so much about human tactics? I have studied your people. Rene Harper give me book to practice your words. Sun Tzu. Ah. I learned much. Sun Tzu. Where can we do the most damage? We share this battle with our strongest Nabi warriors. Go to them. They will mark your kills. Alright. Can do. Guess we'll start with this guy since he's right here. Nice and easy. Many boom here. A Tartuk called Batista. Kill many Navi with boom boom. Batista, right. The boom boom guy. Great. Many Navi die. You must stop the Batista. Your attack will fail. Go. Kill the Batista. I think I remember this guy, actually. I remember him from the RDA side. I know that. So, uh, let's there. hop on a horse. Which one of those is north, and which one of those is my objective? Why, well, neither. Wait, why? Oh, the yellow arrows are the objective, and north arrow is actually a north arrow. For some reason... I had a brief thought there where I, I I thought that the one of the ah one of the yellow arrows symbolized north, which of course would be strange. But is this even gonna? Well, it'll take me to one of the things. So that good enough for me. Do it. Oh boy. Oh boy. Turrets for days, but they're distracted, so I'm just gonna pass right on through. They got this. There's a lot of Navi here. They, they got it. Under control. Ah! Turret, leave me alone. Leave me and my horse alone. Uh oh. I saw that one. Oh, there's another one. Oops. Oops. There we go. Smack. Ow. Fence. Oh, God. He has his, uh, freaking most of his ability. Titan Bash. Yeah, there we go. Yes! There we go. Batista is down. Uh-oh. Glad this fence is bulletproof, apparently. 
we go. That guy. That guy. And that one. Oh, wait. He's still alive. Die. There we go. What happened to the horse? Did they kill the horse? Oh, man. Jerks. Alright, well, I guess we'll head down to the other target before we bother to report back to the first guy. Uh oh. Yep. Shotgun guy, gotta deal with him. And you, and you. Yeah, there we go. Navi friend finish, uh, finished him off. A pod. Oh. Oh. I'm assuming it's this way. Uh oh. You know what? Let's try a club. We haven't used a club in like forever, and now that we have a pretty good level club, this might be fun. Oh, it looks cool though. It looks really cool. Charge! See, the staff hits enemies around me, whereas the uh, the uh, uh, club just hits things in front of me. So I do have to be more mindful of which way I'm facing now, but the club hits a lot harder than the staff does. But also slower, so it's you know, definitely a trade-off. One of these guys had a grenade launcher. Is he dead? The guy with the grenade launcher? I think so. Let's climb up here and grab this... Uh, Grab this, G uh, not GMI, uh, Tree of Vision. And it looks like there's actually one of the guys we need to talk to is right over here. So that's nice. Gimme, give gimme give that. I would take the horse, but we're, like, literally right here, so... Yeah, no point. <laughs> this guy, I think, is gonna give us another target to go after here. Evil Rider, once more I call for your skills. The humans here follow a commander called Winslow. He drives the humans with his words. You must silence him. I'll see what I can do. This you must do. Our attack falters. You must succeed. All right, let's go, man. Let's do this. Where is he exactly? Oh my gosh, he's all the way over there. Wow. Okay. Well, I guess we'll uh, we'll use the GMI over here to not GMI. Jeez, Tree of Vision. I saw one sitting over there, and I know this is also an RDA playable area. So now my head's all messed up. We're gonna head back to here, talk to the other guy. He'll give us our other target, and then we will. Well, he should give us our other target, I think. Um, and then we can try to like maybe multitask a little bit here. So. Yeah, let's try it out and see how it goes. Alright, come here, you. Come on. Alright, I killed the. Uh... Is no more. Indeed. The battle turns in our favor. Sweet. Mission completed. Ooh, oh, sweet. I'm like mid butterfly twist. Yes, new armor again, new defensive ability. Ooh, oh wow, look at that sweet skull mask I got. I like it. Let's see, let's uh, let's check it out. Oh, no, let's check it out here. So that, which one was the one we just had? We just had this one. So, oh my god, maximum protection, minimum mobility. Who needs to be able to move though when you can just tank all of the damage, right? Oh my gosh, we are slow though. We are real slow. Ugh. I don't know. I don't know if I can put up with that, but the armor is really cool. And makes me very, very hard to kill. Um, let's see. We only have that one target there. I think if we travel to the other Tree of Vision and start from that point, I think it'll be a little quicker. So let's use the fast travel again. Go down here now. Um, I think after the end of this Let's Play, we're going to have a, a period of time where I'm only going to do one Let's Play at a time because Subnautica is coming out on the Xbox One very soon, and I want that to be the next Let's Play, uh, without a doubt. So, we will be putting, uh, we will be putting the double videos on hold for just long enough for Subnautica to come out, uh, so that I can start that Let's Play without having to wait to finish another one. Maybe if I can find something short... 
I'll slot that in there. Like, I know the, um, the Battlefield 4 campaign is only seven missions, so that would be... I could run it as seven episodes, uh, which would only take a week. So, depending on when this finishes, we might be able to squeeze in the Battlefield 4 campaign, just so that there's something for you guys. Um, I think the Battlefield 4 campaign is fun. I, I like it. I, I know it's not, like... It doesn't have, like, the craziest story development or anything like that, but I think it's a fun campaign. So, um, yeah. It's one option. Let's try to head down here. Oh god, oh god, no, 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 Hold on. Oh yeah, he is in here. We're going the right way, cool. Might as well hop off of that guy right now. Let's cloak. Oh, why did the gate open? What happened? That's so strange. Hey-ya! Triple kill. Yeah! That turret had no idea where I was. Woohoo! Where are you? There you are. Uh, yeah. Ah, grenade launcher guy. Somewhere. Where? Okay, you've got to die. There's no ifs, ands, or buts about that. Nope, nope, nope. He's got a machine gun. He's got a big honking machine gun. Alright, hold on. Ah! Yeah! Ow! Don't play that game, do you? Where, where'd you go? Aha! One, two, three, four, five, special... Ah, oh, there we go. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Is it, is it the scorpion? Or whatever it is shooting at me? Ah, it is! Four shots. Let's make them count. I can't even aim that far. I don't have the range. Yeah! We hit it. Yep. Yeah, nice. Awesome. All right. So there's that. Oh, they're, they're respawning quickly. Let's just let's just get out of here. You know? Where is? Okay, if we head that way, we can get to a GMI really quickly. Let's go that way. Also, that will unlock another GMI for us. I wanted to hit that drone. There we go. Oh, speaking of drones, another one. There we go. And viper wolves? Is that friendly viper wolves? Oh, it's not a viper wolf. It's one of these deer things. What are these called? Hold on, what are you called? Hexapede. There we go. Try to remember that. There's another tree of vision, and we're going to probably use this one. Yes, we're going to use this one to travel back to here. And turn this one in, and then hopefully someone will pop up to give us our third target. And let's see. I guess I'll grab the horse real quick, Stay just calm. because we move so slowly on our own. Because of this new armor that makes us really, really hard to kill. Again, I am amazed. Many believed Winslow could not be killed. We will now press our attack. Awesome. Uh, where do we go now, I guess? I don't... Hold on. Mount the Banshee and report to the third Navi leader. Is there a Banshee somewhere for me to to mount? Let's see, that's a dire horse. That oh, there we go. Sweet. Yes, we get to ride the Banshee, the Ekron. Taruk, I've missed you. It's been so long since we actually got to ride you. Is it gonna be a cutscene or do I get to do it? Yay, I get to do it. Sweet. Uh, let's see, we're heading that way. Can do. Oh, I can't fly too high. I can't fly higher than this. Alright, that's fine. Whatever, it's all good. Which way should I go? I guess it doesn't matter? I don't know. Let's see how straight across I can do. Like, how much of the map can I kind of just ignore since I'm flying? Pretty good amount of the map, to be honest. Hold on, can I... Oh, uh, I want to just get in here and... 
land real quick. Just to activate the tree of vision. Easy Done with that. that. Okay, cool. Just, I mean, we were flying over it, you know, so might as well. How high can I fly? Can you guess not high enough? Not high enough. Uh oh. Uh oh. Go that way. There you go. You got it, buddy. You got it. Don't think you're getting through there. Nope. Okay, so we gotta go the long way around. Oh well. Get some scenic flying and stuff, you know? Pretty cool. Can't fly higher than this, but. lock up here. What happened? Oh, it's loading. Okay, we're good. We're alright. We're fine. Oh, those link chambers down there. Maybe they're just little utility buildings. I missed the... whatever. It's fine. I think we can get over there from here. Yeah. We're good. Then we need to head this way. This is so cool! We don't get to fly this guy off enough. All these little things on the walls, they suck if you're playing as the RDA. They are a serious pain. Hold on. Hold on. There's a G there's a the, the tree of vision down here. I want it. I don't even have to land. Sweet. Just go ahead and grab it and take it right back off again. Nice! Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Yeah, we don't want wait. Oh no, no, no. Get away, get away, get away, get away, get away. Okay, I think we lost it. Or at least lost it well enough. Uh, where am I going here? This way. Ah! Sorry, buddy. You don't you don't turn that well, apparently. Hold on. I think we can go, yes, through here. Okay, cool. We don't have to worry about the vines. Though that was cool that we ended up going between them, kind of on accident, but looked really neat in the end. Can't fly higher. I can't fly higher. Oh, there we go. Now I can. Sweet. Thank goodness they'll let me land up here just to save some time. No, it's alright, man. Come back. It's fine. He's not gonna kill you. He's he's a friendly he's a friendly Ekron. Our assault does not succeed. Our spears and arrows cannot take down the metal demon. Let me guess. An amp suit. The Totut called Savoy wears a skin of metal. He stops our attack. Let water stops fire. The quartermaster, huh? I guess he saved the best gear for himself. This should be interesting. Hmm. Mm hmm. Well then, where is he? Back that away. Shall we? Shall we go on foot? Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Looking at. Let's see. Ah, you know, this might be one of those times that it's better to just call this a, a little bit of a short episode because anything we do now is going to be way too involved to finish in like one minute. So I think we'll call it good here for this episode of James Cameron's Avatar of the Game. After all, I said, you know, the goal was around about 20 minutes, give or take a couple minutes. So we're, we're in that range right now. I think we'll call it good here. So thank you very much for watching this episode of James Cameron's Avatar the Game as the Navi. I hope you have enjoyed, and as always, I hope to see you all in the next one.